Hello everyone, hope you're well. Really looking forward to seeing you on Sunday and those that are joining us on the online service, it will be uh, great to see you sometime soon. You know, we live in a world where there's lots of opinions on, oh, we should be doing this or we shouldn't be doing that and we should be uh, uh, doing this over here and you shouldn't be uh, doing that as well. It, it, there's lots of confusing advice around at the moment and who knows what exactly the right thing is to do and who could say for certain, oh, this is the will of the Lord and how we should tackle uh, this issue. But, you know, in this uncertain time, there is something that is certain. There is something that we can say that this is the will of the Lord for you if you're a believer. And it's be some familiar verses that Jesus tells us in John chapter 13. He says, A new commandment I give to you, that you love one another, just as I have loved you. You also are to love one another. By this, all people will know that you are my disciples, if you have love for one another. And, uh, you know, this passage, people sometimes apply it to, um, as we you know, love one another, we show love to the people around us and to the world around us. And, yeah, through other scriptures, that's you know, clearly something that we should do as Christians. But primarily, it is Jesus addressing the love between the disciples or the love between us as his followers. We are to love one another. We are to be kind to one another. We are to look after one another. We are to help one another in this time. We are to speak well of other people, particularly on social media. You know, there's a lot of things going on social media where people seem to have very strong opinions and uh, they, they put them out there, but it comes out as uh, aggressive rather than loving on and accepting. We're to show other, one another love. We're to shower love on people by being kind to them, by doing uh, things for them, by looking for how we can help one another of us I I in the church. This is what God wants us to be doing at this time, this time where many people are uh, uh, just sort of focusing on their own needs, on their own situation, on their own survival, if, if you like. Uh, we, as the church, should be looking out for one another. As Jesus says, a new command I give to you, that you love one another, just as I have loved you. You also are to love one another. By this, all people will know that you are my disciples, if you have love for one another. My friends, let's love one another. I'm just going to pray. Lord Jesus, thank you that you chiefly demonstrated your love for us, Lord God. You came and you served, Lord God, and you came and you gave your life to make a way for us to know you. And Lord, I just pray for each person listening, Lord God, that you would just fill them with your love, Lord God. That they would know your love even today. They would know a fresh touch of your love, Lord God. And then through that, Lord God, they would show your love to the people around them, Lord God. And I pray this in Jesus' name. Amen. Be blessed. Have a great day. And looking forward to seeing you on Sunday. And if you can't make the actual services we're having here, looking forward to seeing you soon. God bless.